again. Another review. Yay. Well, uh, this time we're doing another Transformer review of da -da -da -da, um, Generation 1 Mirage. Mirage. <clears throat> right. Different packaging, different uh, because it's made by Takara. Takara. And this is, as I was saying, Generation 1 Mirage. He is nice. But let's start off with the review of the packaging. So, up front, you can see the transform robot mode. As you can see, Mirage. And I can't read that. Can somebody read that? Give me a comment or anything, whatever. <clears throat> and this one. Uh, oh. So Japanese thing, Subtron, and Transformers. Mm. Inside you have Transformers with niched plastic design of the Autobot insignia. On the other side you have the clear view of the Formula One racer that is Mirage. Wait. And on the top, oops, see through. On the bottom, you got more Japanese stuff happening around here, and it's it says Transformers Classics. And on the back, we have Barrage transforming from his vehicle mode to the robot mood and uh, yeah bottom part the other classics of Takara Optimus Prime but will be it's a uh, Grimlock and Megatron Stars Queen you get the first sign between so you know that's Decepticon and Autobots Okay, I'll be back. I'll open the box. Okay. And Mirage is out of the plastic. And what we have here is the vehicle mode of Mirage. Right, now let's on, get on the review. Hello. Now let's get on with the review of Mirage. Right. As you can see, this is a very nice figure. Very nice vehicle, actually. You got chrome bumper. Chrome spoiler. Nice indeed. Look at that. Oh. You got turning wheels, plastic. It's plastic, but that's all right. Main difference with this one from the original Generation One Mirage is, well, um, I guess the driver's cockpit or the side or original one did have a windshield, but this one has one. And I don't know if you guys can see it. I don't think that you can, but. Mirage's head is actually inside there. Hmm? So, quick 360 of the profile of the car, and look at that. Uh huh. Nice. You've got the Autobot insignia there. Very nice. He still has the number 26 number. Look at that form. I so love this form. Spoilers can go up and down. Probably for aerodynamic. He has four mufflers. There. And... What does it say about this? Except that this is so gorgeous. It's a very nice vehicle, actually. reason why I got this one because... Uh, the 
the hobby shop shop that I bought him said this was the last Mirage classic Mirage and I kind of like buying collecting those some um, one of a kind transformers so I was like blue you know it's personal preference but personally I like Mirage Mirage um, was very cool level-headed Autobot you know but damn this is good nice very nice vehicle on it uh, they also came with this one it was uh, got catalog the uh, artwork of all the transformers you got a black and white thing happening with Megatron and a small comic freaking it's all Japanese you now times like this I wish I knew how to read Japanese <laughs> but I can't it also came with the instruction manual but how can you read an instruction manual in Japanese but Let's not do the uh, transformation with the manual. Mm, it came with this one. I think this is. I don't know. Card? Whatever. Mirage. And there's a glass. Tie wires. <clears throat> right. Again. Very nice vehicle indeed. I give this guy perfect 10. So sue me if I liked him. <laughs> Very nice. Not much any uh, robot parts underneath. It's chrome. It's nice. Okay. So uh, watch out for my part two as I review the robot mode of Mirage. See you later, dude.